What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Marvel's Avengers video and today I'm going to be showing you how to get the Treasure Trove achievement. This one can be a bit confusing because it says to open 50 cash strong boxes, but it doesn't really specify which one. So you don't really know if because you're opening the strong boxes if those count, but they don't. Regular ones you find out in the world do not count. It has to be ones that are found inside shield bunkers so you can find these during the vault missions things like that but the best way to do this guys is to do one of the inhuman missions which is going to be found in the pacific northwest and it's going to be called days of the remains now this one's going to be the fastest way guys so if you want to throw it on the easiest difficulty and pick a flying hero it will be quicker to navigate through the areas you're trying to go all right, guys, so as soon as you land on the mission, first thing you want to do is just head straight to the main objective. Once you get there, guys, don't worry about listening to what they're saying. You don't have to worry about that. Just go ahead and keep heading straight. Now, from here, guys, once you continue to head straight towards this wooded area, you should see a little radar pop up in your top left corner indicating that there is a bunker nearby once you arrive here guys just go ahead and open it up as such you can already see the shield cache icon already on screen just gonna run in open it up and this will be the first one right here and you'll notice that it has a shield logo on it that's the way to, you can tell the difference between just the regular cache at strong boxes and these now in here guys there are going to be some other chests like this and there's also typically one or two cracked walls that you can bust through let's see if we can find one just to give you an idea and these are these really just um, give you more resources and things like that so right here guys is a cracked wall you can punch through and sometimes there's stuff and sometimes there's not maybe there's one more right here and boom there it is a few chests right here or a few uh, crates with resources Nothing much, but we don't have to worry about fighting these guys. We're just going to run back and head straight to the next main objective. Now, once you arrive over here, guys, uh, you can actually knock out two trophies with this run. You can open up these and uh, free the prisoners, which is going to give you the trophy for the prisoners. Or you can just run straight down here into the bunker that's going to open up as soon as you get over here. And here is chest number two. So that's all you have to do, guys, to complete this run. As you saw right there, it took, I mean, maybe three or four minutes. If you add in the loading screens and if you search around for the cracked walls and the other chest in here, then you're probably looking at around five or six minutes per run. But if you're just going for those chests, guys, those caches, then you're probably, you know, three or four minutes tops, not counting the loading screens. It's as simple as that, guys. Well, I hope you found this useful towards getting that trophy. I hope this cleared it up for you. If you found this video useful at all, guys, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more Marvel Avengers content and more gaming content in general. Thank you guys so much. I hope you have a good one.